All right, tonight we get another look at the wildly talented Magomed Ankalaev, not just one of the best light heavyweights in the world. For my money, one of the top 20 pound-for-pound -pound athletes on this roster top to bottom. I feel like he can compete with anyone, but I also feel like he has a style that translates weight classes, and that is what pound for pound feet means. This guy can strike. This guy can grapple. This guy has tremendous cardio. I don't think anything points to that more than the Bohovich fight. When it went bad, he just pivoted and did something different and almost became the champion. Tonight, he's got to be on his game if he wants to get his hand raised. And a lot of people believe against any 205er in the world, Magomed Ankalaev would be the betting favorite. Let us see how he handles this stylistic challenge in front of him tonight. Still undefeated, here is Hamzat Shimaya making the walk tonight as a middleweight. A lot of people think eventually he's going to be a UFC champion and he's got a big fight in front of him tonight. I mean, this guy's a monster, you know, from his mindset to the way that he competes. Hamzat Shimaya is one of those guys that passes the eye test. The moment you lay eyes on him, you said this kid has something special about him. He has great wrestling, he has great striking, he has great cardio. The guy has it all. And I'm so excited to once again watch him compete and sit here in his seat and call his fight. The work ethic has never been an issue, perhaps the diet at times when it comes to getting down to 170 pounds, but this man is a problem and ready to impose his will here tonight. Kamzat Shumayev steps inside the octagon and is ready to fight. Our tale of the date for this middleweight championship fight. All right, now for the introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Magomed and Goliath. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending UFC undisputed middleweight champion of the world. Hamzat Bors Shabaya! Herb Dean, our referee for Ready. this one. Ready. Do it. All right, Hamzat Shumayev is back as this round gets underway. Undefeated fighter who has officially taken this sport by storm. His fight against Gilbert Burns back at UFC 273 probably is going to end up in the Hall of Fame. But Hamzat didn't want to talk about that this week at all. He wants a quick night at the office. He wants to get a finish and actually said he believes it's going to materialize on the feet and not the ground. We shall see. And there he goes, lands another combination. His cardio is so good that it allows him to put forth this type of output in pace. When his opponent is done at two, he is stringing together four, five, six more different strikes. You don't do that without having fantastic cardio. Oh, straight punch. High impact takedown for Hamzat Shumayev early, and clearly he's taking the path of least resistance today. I watch Hamzat Shumayev, and I'm always amazed at his ability to not only get takedowns, but get them so easily. And it seems like it takes so little effort to get the fight to the ground. He will tell you what he's going to do, and he is constantly doing exactly that. Stay tight, stay tight. Oh. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Excellent ground and pound there by Hamza Chimaya. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. 
Well, the ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Chimaev. There it is. Now he's going to bump. Under two minutes now to go in the round. This is where he wants to be. One minute. Gotta get out of there. Oh, big elbow. All right, so he's got the body locked down here, DC, or so it appears. This is not a guy you want anywhere near your back. Shimaev's got the full mount. And now he's a tip choke. Oh, he's in trouble here, DC. He's got the triangle with a lot of pressure going down on his opponent. up on the submission now, so preferring to maybe get to a dominant position instead. Huh. Five minutes in the books. You're being controlled on the ground here. He gets the takedown, and he's going to put your feet on his hips immediately and push off. Don't rest until you're back up on your feet. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. Ready to fight. Ready. Good. Second round here. That's a solid punch. That one definitely got through. Straight right is there. Goliath gets caught by yet another straight punch. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that pitch. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. The fighters separate. Just misses with that one. Continues to sway with every huge shot being landed. Back and forth we go. Oh! Great take down defense right now by the champ. Now he gets a more dominant position with the underhook. He is going to start to drive these over and over. You got to be careful here. You got to move. Shumayev's pretty swollen now in that jaw area. It doesn't appear to be affecting him all that much, but he's absorbed a lot of strikes to the head. Got to figure out a way to raise the guard and be more defensively sound. Oh, big hook. That will leave the mark. He's going to get it to him. but live to fight another day. Under a minute now to go in the round. All right, he's hanging out inside the closed guard of his opponent here, DC. You gotta be careful. Striking from every position lands a strike from the bottom. Well, any time you are in a ground-fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. 
Oh, now looking to posture up, and he lands a big uh. head strike. Nicely done there by Magomed Akalai. All right, there's the end of the round. I'm looking over to my left, UFC President Dana White. I think he's making out the bonus check right now. Incredible back and forth out Sign the check, boss. These two young men deserve 50,000. Hell, let's give them each 100,000 for the performance that they just put on in one round. Both were hurt. Both were able to withstand the punishment. And I can't wait until the next round gets started. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want Ready. to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner. <laughs> I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up that much. Look for him to throw that overhand here again. Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 44 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USC middleweight champion of the world, Hamzat Boris Kamaya. All right, Hamzat Shumayev, your winner by knockout here tonight. Not quite as quick as the knockout of Gerald Mershart, but another quick night at the office.